everybody's having an amazing day today. Today is Friday. Hopefully today goes by fast. Just because of everything that's been going on. Y'all know. Y'all know what's been going on. not a broke. Oh, no, he, didn't he didn't break. Anyways, um, I used to love going to work. I used to love being there all the time. Like, I was just like, it's time for work already. It's time to go to work. And yeah, now it's just like, hmm, I gotta go to this place now. Pretty much, yeah. But anyways, oh my God, I love when people have their Christmas lights out. I just love driving by and just looking at the lights. They're so pretty. Like right here, there's a fire station right here. I don't know if I could turn you that far. I don't know. Y'all could see like the little, the little stuff they have right there. There's like a little light right there. Hold on. You'll be able to see more. Just a second. See it? See them right there? So, yeah, that's a fire station that I pass by every day. And um, they have their the outside set up. Anyway, so last night, my dogs got into a little scuffle. Got jealous because I was playing with one dog and I wasn't playing it with the other dog. And they bit me. Yeah. And I got scratched. Let's see it right there. Right there. Right here. Right there. Yeah. Um, they got jealous because I was playing with one and I wasn't playing with the other. And... The one started fighting with the other, and yeah, they got into a little scuffle. I mean, not bad. I mean, they didn't, you know, nobody was hurt or anything. It's just that um, when I was trying to get them apart, they were already mad at each other, but they weren't fighting with, the, they were fixing a fight with each other. So whenever I tried to get them apart, they thought it was them. You know what I mean? They thought it was... Um, they thought it was the dog that was fighting. So... They got mad. Okay. I came this morning so I can get me a biscuit. But guess what? The drive through is like super packed like the cars were all the way out to where the front door of the restaurant is like are you freaking kidding me like that many cars both of the drive throughs are open so I'm like okay well I'll just go inside well I go inside and I'm ordering I was like hey I need a biscuit and uh I think she was waiting for me to order my water, but I didn't order a water. Actually, I got smart and I brought my, my Yeti with me. I was like, why am I getting a cup when I can just use my cup? I forgot about my cup. I'm like, okay, forgot about my cup. It is freaking foggy right now. Oh my god. And another thing is. Y'all know how my husband's been. Bringing the car the last few days. There is trash. All on the floor. Literally trash. All over the floor. And like candy wrappers everywhere and I'm like oh my god 
But he tried to say, it wasn't me. I didn't do it. Yeah. You've been driving the car lately. Not me. So yeah, he drives the car and tries to act like he didn't do it. So, yeah. Anyways, but yeah. So I'm on my way to work. Before I let you go, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if y'all haven't already. Hit that little bell to get notified whenever I post a video. Share, share, share everywhere. And I am so sorry I didn't do my morning routine this morning. I mean, since my hand is hurt, um, I couldn't really do it, hold on to the to my denture that, that good. But all I used this morning was the Dr. B's and I did it halfway like I usually do. I did not put extra dots. I just did it without the extra dots just to see how it will work today. So, so far, excuse me, so far, it feels snug in there. So, that's a good thing. Um, but, yeah. Um, we'll see how it does throughout the day. And see how everything else is going throughout the day. But, I'll be back in a little bit. Look how it looks out here. Look at all that fog. Craziness. Anyways, I'm going to do outfit of the day real quick. So yeah, that's outfit of the day. Hey guys. Oh, look at the lighting. I think if I wore makeup, I think it would look cool. My cheekbones would look good. I had to put on another band-aid because the, the bottom one was coming apart already because I got it wet. So today, I hope it goes by fast because I'm just ready to go home to my husband. I need to go, I'd rather be at home and be with him instead of being here. Oh, and another thing is, um, my ankles have been swollen. Like, they've been swelling up so bad that, I, oh, excruciating pain. Like, I can't even... I just, like, I can't wait to get home and sit down and relax. And this morning, this hand was swollen again. Well, minus, you know, I got bit and it's swollen right here on the bottom. But on the back side, you can tell. You can tell it's still swollen. If you can tell right there, you can't see my bones. But if you look at my other hand, see how you can see all my bones? Yeah. And I'm tightening it just like the other one. But look. You can't see the bones. Go figure. I don't know what the deal is. I don't know why. I thought I, thought I had something on me. Um, yeah, so my hand's still swollen. It hurts on my elbow. Um... So, I don't know what the deal is. The doctor said I had arthritis, but I don't know. I haven't went to my my physician, my personal physician. I haven't went to him to see what's going on. I've just been going to my back specialist. That He just tells me, yeah, you have arthritis, but he hasn't confirmed it. Because I have to go to my regular doctor. So, once I do that, I will find out for sure what's going on, if I have arthritis, what kind of arthritis it is, or, you know, all that stuff, and see why I'm getting swollen, but I need to go see the doctor just to confirm, you know, what it is that I have, or what's going on with me, or why I'm, my body's doing this, but soon, I'll go to the doctor soon. Hey guys, uh, just wanted to let y'all know what was going on. Feel like a fat roly pony. Yeah. Anyways, I had to put another band aid. I don't know if I told y'all. I had to put another band aid on my finger. Um, this other one was coming off. I haven't even looked at it to see how bad it looks. I should. I'll wait till I get home so I can wash it off. But, anyways, um, 
So I asked if I could leave a few minutes early. Not even, like maybe five minutes early. Five. Not even that many minutes early. And I went over there and I asked. I was like, hey, do you think I can leave a few minutes early? And she's like, I don't care. Okay. So I was like, all right. Well, I guess she don't care, so I'm leaving. So, yeah. So I left early. And it's Friday. And it felt like the day couldn't get over with fast enough. It was like it was taking its time. Like literally taking its time. Like every time I looked at the clock, it was like, it wasn't time yet. It was two o'clock. And I looked at it again and it was barely like 2.15. And I'm like, what the freak? I'm ready to go home now. I'm not ready to go home later. You know, the days that you want to go home early, that you want to get out early, are the days that takes forever to leave. You know what I mean? Like, literally. It takes forever to leave. I was just, I kept on texting my husband. I was like, I can't wait to leave. I'm ready to go home. He's like, you're always ready to go home. I was like, yeah, but that's just me. You know, I go to work, I do my job, and then I'm ready to go home. I'm ready to, you know, go home and relax. But today, can't go home and relax. Um, we have to run to Victoria to go pay for the car. And we have to... Oh, we're going to go eat at that restaurant that I was talking about that had good I told you about it in a few videos before but they had like good uh, Mexican food good tamales supposedly I don't know I've never eaten there but I told my husband I was like I want to try it you know because every time we pass by there it is like packed like tons of people there like you wouldn't believe how many people are there you know and you wouldn't think that, I don't know, you see the place from the outside and you'd be like, man, I wouldn't think that place would be that packed. It's packed. And they always announce it like on the radios and stuff. And I'm like, I told my husband, I was like, you know what? We need to go try that out. We need to go try it. Because it, it sounds good. So, And I think we saw a commercial on it too. And the food looked good. So, yeah, I just, I don't know, I just want to try it. He's like, whatever you want to do. Yes, I'm spoiled. I am definitely spoiled. And I asked him if we can go buy Bells or JCPenney's because I heard they're having like a sale or something. And plus, I have to get that present for that girl. So, I need to buy that, too. Yeah. I just don't know what to get. Kind of crazy. Because I don't know what to buy. It's for a girl. And I just don't know what to buy. I mean, what would they, what would that person like? need to figure that out big time so yeah i'm on my way home and we have to run to victoria i think that's it i think that's all we have to do my uh teeth have stayed in really good now that i know how to put my uh, adhesive on my mouth or on my denture now that i know that i now that I know how to put the adhesive on my denture, I don't have no oozing in the back. That's something I'm on. Um, it's been doing a lot better. 
and I don't use as much as I did before because when I was putting it all the way around I would use more than what I'm using now like now I'm just using like half let's just say that the food was good here we came to eat adventures and yum like yum yum <laughs> the hubby came to the mall and I'm at JCPenney's right now and we're just we're just looking seeing what they have on sale never know what you can find at on these sales actually I wanted to go to Bell's but because we stopped on this side before with Bell's Bell's usually has a lot better sales than here here they always want every little penny that they can get from me literally but I don't know where the hubby went he's stopped over there on the other side and to So guys, we came to Walmart to get the guys some little snacks. Oh, I need to go get the soap that I like. Well, not soap. The softener. I'm going to walk this way. Anyways, we came to get a few things. But we're supposed to um, come back up here tomorrow. But he wants to come to the movies. They're showing a scary movie. The Possession of Somebody. And, um, excuse me. And uh, Wreck-It Ralph, he wants to watch either one, but I don't know which one. So, I guess we'll see which one we're going to watch. I'll let y'all know. But it's supposed to be either one. The book is supposed to be a good movie. Anyway, I just wanted to show y'all this. We bought this last time. I think I showed it to y'all. And, oh, they got a different kind. What's the difference? Spring version, and then a red. I don't know what happened to my camera, but anyways, I got this one last time and I liked it. I didn't get this one. I don't know what it. It's original. Let me open it and see if I can smell it. Hang on. They must all be new because I've never seen them before. And then they have the little these little guys. So I don't know which one to get. I know I'm gonna get the pink one again. And I don't even, I believe it doesn't even go right here. But I am going to get this. It's only $3.97, so I'm going to get this. 